Hello, Georgie Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. Now, I've been asked to make 10 mail cards. So for the next two weeks, I am going to be making mail cards. Hope that's all right with you. Now, what I did, I went on Pinterest, wrote in, typed in, mail cards, and a load come up. So I decided to make what was on Pinterest. So for this one, I've got a card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths, folded in half at four and one eighth. I have a piece of plaid tidy DSP at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. I have another piece which measures three and a quarter by two inches and this is going to be the collar. Ooh, it'll go on there. That'll be the collar and we'll just trim that off. I have another piece at two and one eighth by two and a quarter. And this is going to be the pocket with a little strip that I cut off the top going to be the hem of the pocket. I have a piece of white card, basic white card at two inches by three and a quarter inches. And that's going to be the bit I stamp happy birthday on that I'll need trimming down. And I've also got a pile of buttons here. These are out of a die from. Hang on, I've got it, got them here. So I don't know how many buttons are here, but these are the buttons, and they are from this set. Hamsonly suited. They're in the dies. this tiny die here with all the buttons. Now all these cards by the way are all retired, all four are going to be retired stamps because I've only got one card, one set of stamps that's current and I did use it but I'm not filming it as of yet. So all these are going to be retired papers, retired stamps um, because that's all I've got and I'm using what I've got so let's get started we'll get this and I'll glue and what we're going to do we're going to glue from this corner to the one diagonally across and we're just going to glue like that And we're going to stick, oh, I've glued the wrong one. Let's do it this way. Don't matter because I'm going to cut that off. Great start, isn't it? Right, want it like this. So I'm putting that corner with that corner, and that corner with that corner, and then I'll just press that down and trim that off, get rid of that. So that's our collar done, quite quick you see. Right, our pocket. Now we've got to shape the bottom, so what I did no measuring, I never did any measuring, just folded it and pinched the bottom and then with my scissors picked somewhere where I could come. So this plaid is there, I just picked a spot on it and cut the corners off to there and did the same the other side. And that's the shape of my pocket. 
and I shall glue that on there. In fact, that's a, quite a bit wide. I'm going to cut some of that off. So that measures five eighths by two inches, and that will go on there. That's better. Doesn't look so big. Right, with the, this, we'll need cutting down once I stamp happy birthday on it. And I've got this one, and I think this one's out of um, Hey Chick. I'm sure it is. Because I opened the box the other day and it weren't there, so. And this is the only loan stamp I've got. So I'm going to stamp that just there. Then what I'm going to do, I am going to measure this. I don't usually, but I will. And I'm going to measure in half an inch. So there's half an inch half an inch and then half an inch down as well I'm gonna cut this half inch off these corners off and that's what they're gonna be like And they're gone there, but now I need to cut some of this off. That's it. That's going to be on like that. In fact, that's too long. So that's better. I don't want all that paper showing. Right, let's cut, glue the hem on. I think I'd call it a hem, I don't know what you'd call it. Detail. Now you don't want it to match up like the pattern because you won't be able to see that it's got a hem on it. And then this will get glued on there, like that, so. Right. That will go on like that there. Now the only thing i have got to put these buttons on, so a bit of glue there, this is fiddly this is, and a button, also put one in the middle of the pocket. To bring some down, I'm going to use this red line.
another one on. Right, now we have all our buttons on. Two left over. And this we will glue on our card base. And this is going on dimensionals. I wondered where that one went. I knew I picked up a, another one. Right, and we'll pop this to the left. Add our piece to the inside. And there's our card. <coughs> Using up scrap papers. Hope you like it. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload. Which is usually a Monday and a Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting. And I hope to see you again soon.